Hey guys, I wanted to show you my new paints. It's by CSY, I think it's Psy. Psy Art Gallery. Now, I'm a big fan of their watercolors. If you ever watch any of my videos, you would know that I love their handmade glittering watercolors. They are gorgeous. And I just found acrylic paint made by them. Look how pretty the colors are. And so I figure, let me show you. Now, this is the second time I tried to make this video. I kind of messed up the other video. Hold on, I'm going to get another chair. I kind of messed up the other video. And then I tried to upload it anyway, or whatever, download it, upload it to YouTube. Anyway, and I, I it wouldn't go through. So I was like, you know what? Maybe that's just better anyway. <laughs> Because I literally dropped my camera like twice and the, the the picture went upside down and I didn't realize it. And I was like, screw it. I'm not great at, I'm not really great at videos anyway. So I figured it'll be good enough. But you know what? And I was talking about dumb stuff. So I figured I'm just going to redo the video just to show you guys this paint. So I'll try to go some do some close-up shots. Um, I don't know if it'll get on the camera. Now, I've already opened these. Like I said, I already tried to do this video, but let's see. It's too shiny. I can't see it. So this this color right here is A-P-O-L-L-P -L -L -P Brown Green. I'm going to say it's pronounced a polyp brown green. This color is so pretty. It's got this really neat, like, under... Oh, like, you could see it in the camera, or on the lid right here. It's got, like, this undercover of red, and then above it, this brown green. It's just so pretty. Check it out. Let's see. I'll pan a little bit, and I'll bring the... I'll bring it up to you, because you know what? Um, I tried to take the camera down, like I said... And I dropped the camera the last time. So I'm just going to bring the book up to the camera. <laughs> and um, I found these, like I usually do, on Amazon. Okay, check it out. All right, look at that. Look how pretty that is. Isn't that beautiful? I am a huge fan of this company. They are... In Germany, now this is what I've this is what I learned. Um, they're in Germany. It's all handmade paints, and I bought I bought so many of the watercolors. I probably have every color they have ever made in watercolors, and they are sometimes. And I could tell they're handmade because sometimes they come out real chalky, and other times it's gorgeous. Okay, look at that color. And other times it's just so pretty. So you can never tell. I guess because they're handmade, they, um, you know, it's always going to be a little different. You know what I should do? You know what I should do? I should do this. I'm going to add a little water to see if what happens. Water it down. So pretty. These colors are so pretty. I love it. I'm going to do it to this, the, um, up, 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 brown, green. <laughs> Let's see what happens. I got a can, I got a, um, a fan on, so it probably will, um, dry pretty quick. So this color right here that I just did is called sparkling wine. Let me try to put these in order so I know. Now, you got, I can kind of tell which one it is without um, remembering or keeping them in order. I'll bring it up to you in a little bit, um, the book, because I want to kind of um, let this dry a little bit. All right, let's see. They're just so pretty. I want the wet part. This one didn't change too much. Like it doesn't have like an undercover color popping out. 
This color is called, hold on, wait, Glittering Copper. Boom. All right, I'll bring this one up. I'll just do it. Here you go. Look how pretty. I'll try to get the shine out. Look how pretty those colors are. I love this paint. And this is acrylic paints as opposed to the watercolor I was telling you about. <laughs> All right, now this one's called Wheat Gold. And they're two ounce bottles and it's, they're, look how, I mean, just look how pretty. I mean, you see that? It's, it is that beautiful. And this is um, a mixed media book, but it's mainly like a, a pretty nice watercolor paper. Um, what kind of book is this? I forget. Oh, uh, Strathmore. It is watercolor paper. It's not really mixed media, sorry. Um, but I use it for mixed media. I use um, gouache in there, markers, colored pencils, regular charcoal. This color is called Champagne Gold. Right? Oh, come on, man. This paint's beautiful. Don't even pretend you don't think so. I made a short showing the paint. Um... yesterday but that was because um i couldn't get that other video to upload so hopefully this one will upload i used too much water on this one i don't like it i'll try to tap it down a little bit there we go let me do a thirsty thing here a thirsty with my pen my uh, paintbrush get it up it, yeah. Okay. All right. Now I got one more color and it's white. Yeah. So this came in a, um, a set of six. This one is called silver dust. See that it has such a pearly gray, pearly a gray pearl. It like, Sometimes, like in different color, uh, different lights, it seems like it's a little bluish. But right now, this light is like it's kind of raining out, so I don't see the sun out. But um, this isn't, it doesn't look blue today to me. It looks like a white gray. Let me bring that up to you. Let me bring that up to you. All right. Let's see if so I can get the shine off. Okay. Ah, I still see the shine. There it goes. Pretty, right? And they're beautiful. This one, I love this one. This I think this one's my favorite color. Nice, right? Yeah, love, love it. I love, and I think it's pronounced Sai or Sai. Sai Art Gallery. Extreme Glitter Metallic Acrylic Paints. And these are the two ounce bottles. Yeah, these are two ounces. I'm trying to see if there's any other information in here. So I'm assuming that these are handmade too, but I don't know. Um, I don't know that for sure because I know the watercolors are, and I love the watercolor. So anyway, I wanted to show you my new paints. Let's see. Um, I'm working on a, a an oil painting. I was going to paint a picture of me and my friend, but it, it was coming out terrible, just absolutely terrible. So I chose this picture of, oh my God, um, Clint, Gustav Clint, Klimt, <laughs> Gustav, 
the guy is, just looks like such a character. I don't think I've ever seen a picture of him without this robe on. Or the, and he looks like a wizard, right? But I just know it's a, like a painting, uh, a, you know, protect his clothing or whatever. But I just never seen him without this on. <laughs> Even when, like, he's in a picture with the rest of the the artists and they're in like suits, he's wearing this. And I don't know why, but he just looks like somebody that I would totally get along with or not get along with. Maybe I'd fight him. I don't know. <laughs> fight with him. But I wanted to show you my, um, my paintings thus far. I just started it. I'm coming over to the other side because I am not going to try to take it off the the clamp here because I just know I will drop it like I did. So there it is right there. That's the painting right there. And uh, let me see. Maybe let me see if I can. No, I can't. See the light right there? It's It's shining too bright on it. In the camera, it looks too bright, but yep, there, there it is. I just started it. I oh, know. I think it's looking up pretty good. And also, um, this is my um, my huge acrylic painting I was doing. It takes up like the entire wall. Can't even get it in the entire picture. And pretty sure I'm done. You see how long it is? Uh, it's probably, I think it's about nine feet across and maybe, let's see, probably maybe four and a half feet up and down. I'm going to guess. I, see, I can't even get it in the entire, yeah, I can't even get it in the, in the camera shot. My room ain't big enough <laughs> to back up. Yep. So anyway, um, wanted to show you guys that. And, um, also I wanted to say thank you for all the, the views. Thank you for sticking by me. Like I haven't made a video in a while, probably in over a week, um, cause of the depression I was telling you guys about. Um, I feel like I'm, I'm finally getting a little past it, but, um, you know. That's life, right? You know what helps me? Art <laughs> and um, making videos and just sharing stuff with you guys. I'm, I feel like I'm getting a little better at it. Some days, like right now, I feel like I'm a little awkward. But um, then there's other days where I feel like I'm like right on, right? Like I, I feel like I'm, I'm being myself and I'm showing you guys like my joy in art and stuff like that. Today I feel a little awkward, and I just wanted to show you guys um, some of my my new paints today. So thanks for watching. Okay, bye bye.